Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Vanilla Pooping Evolved server. Hope you guys are having a good day today. My day is going pretty darn well, and I just want to say thank you guys so much for your support on the Ark series. Whether you watch modded Ark or you watch Vanilla Ark, I appreciate your support. Um, I know the schedule has been a little wonky lately. And the, the reason for that is, you know, I am enjoying Anunnaki just a little bit more than vanilla. But, uh, you know, that, that's not to say that the schedule won't go back to the way it was. There are, there is, you know, some more interest in Anunnaki than there is in vanilla. I think everybody's pretty much seen what vanilla has to offer, but you know, I, I am going to continue to play it here. Um, the episodes may or may not be few, like fewer uh, I was doing every other day and now I am going to do it probably three to four times a week. Um, maybe, I don't really know. I, I think I probably end up, will will end up doing it every other day still. Um, just right now I'm prepping for a vacation, uh, that will happen. Uh, I'll be on the vacation while, um, while you guys are watching this, I'll be gone. I leave on Thursday and I think this video goes out on Saturday. Yeah, Saturday, according to my list. So, um, yeah, that's that's why, you know, Anunnaki is a little easier to record because there's a lot of content in it. Uh, but uh, I figured we'd come over here to Vanilla and we'd do a little bit more. Now, you can see over here, uh, we got Becca, our Rex, but there's also a absence of dinos. And we go ahead and look here. Your Trevor, your Stephanie, your Trent, and your Carrie have all been killed by an Alpha Carnotaurus. Alpha Carnotaurus. Um, so I logged in today and I uh, noticed that my dinos were gone. Wasn't really sure, you know, what had happened, why my dinos were gone. And, uh, you know, I pulled up my tribe logs and that's what I saw. And so it looks like there is a possibility of an Alpha Carno spawning in our base. And so that's not good. That's no bueno. We don't want that. Uh, it is definitely not something that we want to have to deal with on a regular basis. So we're going to have to try and take some prevention measures towards that. I don't really know what I'm going to do just yet, but we are going to have to do something. But what we are going to do right now here in this moment is we're going to switch over to using this other house because, you know, I built this house, but I haven't really used it at all yet. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to come over here and we're going to start setting this place up for, you know, what we intended to use it for, for an actual house. Uh, we did do some stuff last episode where we actually... Uh, put in some storage you know we've got our, our cool drum set in here that you know we can jam on from time to time if we want to um i've got a bookshelf in here i don't really have anything in the kitchen yet but i will i probably want to switch on some of these wall torches as well uh but we got our balcony back here but you know that's that's besides the point what i want to do here real quick is uh one thing at least this is going to be a dining room area, but I want to go ahead and throw up the workshop. So I'm thinking like right here, maybe I'll put it this way so it can be against the wall. So let's do that. Let's go ahead and put in our smithy. There we go. That's That doesn't look too bad. And so we've got that. We're going to need a table. And then I want to put my, my forges upstairs. We're probably going to eventually... Uh, switch to some better forges or a better forge, uh, you know, just because of the um, the gas or industrial forge. But for right now, I think these will be a good bit to go with. And I want to be able to fit four of them in here. Do I need to? Yeah, there we go. So go ahead and fit four in there. And they are all back to back to back. Awesome. So those are taken care of. And then a mortar and pestle. I do want to get this down here as well. But we need to make a, uh, a table. We need to make a couple of tables. Um, this little area over here is pretty, pretty run down and everything. So I don't want to live in this place anymore. We're going to do something else with this area. So uh, I think, like I said, we'll grab that. Let's do some metal here. Got some of that. Now, I also, I think that any of the structures that we want to make that are wood furniture, wood, 
the table. Yeah, it takes 12 metal. So why don't we go ahead and take eight metal. So we need four more. One, two, three, four. Well, no, that's 20 metal. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and put away four. One, two, three, four. There we go. And then we're going to come over here and grab some wood off of Carl. Got that. There we go. And we're going to craft another one. That way I can have those. And here we go. Got that, got that. Okay, so now we're going to come back over here. I'm going to gamma up just a little bit more. And we're going to put this in this area. Now, I was thinking... Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Like I said, I want to go ahead and put a table in here. And this is going to be our dining room area. So let's go ahead. I want to. I want this to be pretty lined up. So that one's placed there. Wooden table, very nice. And then we, we have this mortar and pestle area. So I'm thinking I might line this up a little bit here. Oh, it's definitely not straight. So let's line that up. Okay. So now we have our little workshop area here. And go ahead and put my mortar and pestles on this. And I will probably want to do a third one here eventually. So I'm just going to do like one of those numbers. That way we have the two of them on there. And we are set. So... What I need to do now is I probably need to take my RG up and try and find uh, some different materials. Now, I did come back on my Rex. Let's see. I think I'm going to take the Rex over here towards the house. Come on, Mr. or Mrs. Rex, I guess. Not Mr. Rex, Mrs. Rex. Go ahead and use some more berries. Dun, 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 dun. And unwhistle. And I had some obsidian. Maybe I put all the obsidian actually in this smithy over here, but I need to start transferring materials. So I'm going to transfer materials. Um, I got my storage set up and I think I'm going to probably tear this place down and we're going to make some more progress today on our base. All right, guys, we're back and I'm going to try. Oh, a mega prana right there in front of me. Level 130. Oh boy. A couple of them. All right. All right. This is how it's going to be. This is how we're going to start our day. Mega piranhas. Just in my face, dealing with... Oh, man. I feel like I could take these things out, but they're not doing very well. All right. Chop, chop, chop. Wow, there are a lot of Mega Piranhas over here. All right, well, I was going to try and go in the river right here by my place and try my best to get some oil, but the downfall to that is most definitely... The fact that there's a hundred thousand mega piranhas in here. All right. Well, we might have to. I'm gonna run out of stamina just trying to kill these things. Here we go. Here we go. I feel like I need to go tame a shark. Look, there's another one. There's another one. Level eighty. Goodness gracious. All right. All right. Got that. Got that. I'm tired. All right, so let's back up out the water. Let's lay down for a minute. Okay, well, it looks like there's actually like silica pearls in this water here. It looks like there is oil in this water here, and that's just about everything that we're going to need. So I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that we won't see any more mega piranhas. And I'm going to pick up silica pearls. I don't know how many more are around here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where did everything go? What? You, what? Uh, um. Okay, I'm not entirely sure why everything is disappearing. Uh, but I am I am concerned for the welfare and well-being of my my game. Uh, let's go back up. Let's go back up. All right. Silica pearls are right there. Let's get our oxygen back. Should have repaired my pick before I started to go off and do this. 
Let's get those. Really? Can I not get... What is going on? This is like uber frustrating. All right. So what about... What about all these silica pearls? Let's come back up. All right. Let's check these out. These little silica pearls right here. Oh, I got them. Oh, no. They all disappeared. Guys, I need your help. What is going on? Why is this happening to me? I don't understand. All I want to do is get silica pearls. Oh, Mega Prana. Oh, Mega Prana. There's two of them. Man, are these like zombies in Minecraft? You hit one and all of a sudden you get 15 more to spawn? Like, what is this? What is this shenanigans? All right. So I'm going to call my bird back. And we're going to get this guy to come and get me. And I guess I'm going to have to go repair my pick and then find a better way to get oil. All right, guys, we're back and we need some more lighting in this place because right now there is not enough. So we need to take a look here and we need to see uh, what would that be under torch torch. OK, so we want the not with the timer. So we need stone, metal and cementing paste. So cementing paste, metal and stone. I wonder if we have any stone. Yeah, there we go. Stone. All right. Go back to torch. So with not the timer, let's go ahead and craft nine of those bad boys. There goes generic B. But if we go ahead and take a look here at my inventory, I got quite a few silica pearls and got quite a few, uh, quite a bit of oil. Uh, and that was going over to the volcano island. If I can show you here on the map, going to the volcano island. And there's a small, small lake kind of to the left, right around 3149 ish. And that's where I went, that lake over there, and it was quite plentiful of all the stuff that I, I wanted. So let's go ahead and put these on the wall here. I'm going to put one right above storage. All right. And then I'm going to put one, I think I'm going to put one on either side of the drum set. There we go. I'm gonna light that drum set up. Very good, very good. Gonna have to throw one next to the bookshelf. Put one above our workstation. That way, you know, we can see what we're doing. And then this door back here definitely needs a couple to go around it. Right over here and over here. And there we go. And this wall 100% needs some more. I think I'm gonna throw one right here and then I am gonna put some on that wall but I think I'm gonna try to wait just a little bit and put some on that wall so the middle of the room is still pretty dark but I need to kind of work out uh, where everything's gonna go and once we get that we'll kind of you know work towards fixing that little bitty problem that we have so uh, what I want to do right now is I want to try to get some of the electrical stuff uh, up and go uh, up and running for our base so I need to go ahead and right outside here on our Rex we should have a ton of hide and I want to grab that I want to come over here and I want to grab probably about a stack of oil and then I'll grab a stack of wood and I've been cooking with wood because I want to get the charcoal. So that's kind of the main reason you guys see that. I'm going to light that fire. And we're going to start with some gasoline. And then I'm thinking we need a fabricator. So to get a fabricator, structures, crafting, we're going to need metal, cementing paste, crystal, and oil. Oh, and spark powder. So we'll need metal. Oh, wait, no, that's not metal. Metal, uh, cementing paste crystal I don't know if I have any crystal let's see crystal yep there's quite a bit of crystal actually a 17 paste metal crystal spark powder uh, what else what else what else let's go ahead and put that in there structures crafting oil and spark powder now spark powder is actually something that I don't actually have a lot of so we're gonna need just a little bit of oil here 
and so I'm going to have to go get some cementing pay or some spark powder, uh, which is actually easy enough. I need an Anki. Uh, I don't actually have one of those yet. And while we're outside, I'm going to go ahead and just turn this up because we don't have a whole lot of lights around. Um, I do want to go ahead and start doing that and start putting up a bunch of lights and everything that we may uh, need. But I'm going to go ahead and tear down this rock. There was a rock that spawned like right here where our house was. Uh, which is really cool because it allows, you know, more resources and stuff to spawn in. But I guess in that case, it allows more dinos to spawn in too. So I might need to go ahead and start putting up structures uh, kind of all around the base just so that, um, you know, we, we don't run into too many spawns, you know, killing our stuff. Because if that Alpha Carno spawns again, I, I, I'm, I was... I'm pretty devastated. Like our, our trike's gone. One of our stegos is gone. We lost one of our beavers. It was just, it was all around bad to see that happen. Do you have anything on you? You just have a bunch of eggs on you, which I want to get a refrigerator. So we will do that soon. Let's put that in, that in, that in, not that. So we'll craft those up. And then if there's any more stone in here, there we go. Go ahead and swap that out. Throw that in. Oh, really? Was that all the stone? All right. So here's, I think I need 50 spark powder. Let's go ahead and take a look. Structures, cementing base. Yeah, 50 spark powder. So we're almost there. I think I had like 20 something, so I'm going to need another 20 something. And that should be enough right there. Let's go ahead. Structures, crafting. And there is our fabricator. Uh, we'll have to repair my armor here soon as well. So fabricator, and I think that's probably like the last thing that we'll need. We might do some cannons here in the future. Um, just trying to look and see. Yeah, I think I think that's probably good. All right. So fabricator, I think I'm not really sure where I want to put the fabricator. Maybe the fabricator is something that goes on the second floor because it is a little higher in the tech tree. So it might be, you know, a little bit more uh, heavy, heavy duty. Let's see here. Let's get this lined up right. So against the wall is not really the problem. I have to go this way. There we go. All right, there's that. There's the fabricator. Now, does it stick to the wall too much? No, it doesn't actually look like it might just a, a little bit. But no major problems there. All right, electrical. We have a generator, so I'm going to need to make some electronics. Uh, let's see. Electronics. Uh, electronics. I'm good there. We'll need straight cable. We're going to need to learn all of these. And I'm not going to learn the rest of the stuff right now. Do we have polymer learned? We sure do, which is good. And then the grill. I have learned the industrial grill. And what about the cooker? Okay, that's level 80, and then the industrial furnace is also something. And then there's also the, oh, I don't remember what the last one's called. Let's take a look here and see if we can't find it. It's it's the mortar and pestle version of what we have. There's a vault. I don't know that I'm going to use vaults. There's a bunk bed. I might actually use bunk beds. Refrigerator. Oh, I can't learn the refrigerator. What is that thing called? Oh, it's right there. It's level 85. So we got a little ways to go yet. So, all right. Uh, do we have gas in here? We do. Fantastic. So let me grab some silica pearls, which we should have right in here. I'm going to grab 100. And then let me grab some metal. There we go. Grab 100 of that. And then we are going to start crafting some electronics for some different stuff. So composite... Um, Oh, it's three to one, so I need to grab 300 because I want to make 100 electronics right off the bat. So boom, 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 and then we're good. All right, so we can get this going here. Put that in, composite, turn on, and craft. 100 of those. So uh, what is the ratio for composite? Uh, two obsidian and two cementic based. So I think I have some obsidian. Uh, let's see, 100, and then obsidian. Nope, not in there. Obsidian, there's 59. Obsidian, no. Obsidian, no. 
All right, was that all the obsidian I have? Uh, obsidian? Yep. It looks like that is all the obsidian I have. So probably going to need to make another run to the Volcano Island for that in the future. But I'm going to go ahead and craft what I can now and uh, get that going. So, all right, guys, I'm going to take a second here and uh, craft up some stuff. And all right, guys, we're back. And I am thinking that we need... A generator. Yeah, we do. We need a generator. It's one of those things. You just got to have it. So let's go ahead and get one. And I'm going to place it down. I think I'm actually going to make a stone foundation for this. Let's just get some of that and that. And then we'll come back over here. I think I am going to start to convert my place over to stone here soon-ish. Uh, that way I can, you know, have... I think I might do like stone and up and down. So... Uh, let's see, uh, just two? Yeah, that shouldn't be bad. Alright. If you want to test heat, that will heat up your GPU nicely. Alright, um, yeah, alright. So we come back and we'll grab that. We'll go ahead and place over here. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to place it right around in this area. So do I have... Oh, I can. Nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and place these here. I am going to start off... Oh, maybe I need to do this from this side, maybe? Um, Alright. Got the new 60. Nice. Alright. So, let's flip it around. There we go. It's a little crooked, but you know what? It's not the end of the world. So... That is kind of a bummer, though. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to demolish it and I'm going to go remake it. Because it kind of is the end of the world to me. Maybe just a little bit, you know, just a little little irking, a little, little bummer. Uh, structures, electric, electrical. Let's make another one. Just turn that on for a second just to make another one. All right, get that back. I'm going to turn that back off. And then we're just going to run outside and... Brrr, Oh! Stuck in this stupid hole again. What the? Alright, you guys are going to see it. I'm going to cheat fly. And this hole is going to be the bane of me. Am I walking? Yes, I'm walking. Okay. So, that hole is bad. <laughs> don't, don't jump off your house into that hole. Alright, so we'll just come straight out here. Right about there. There we go. We are straightened up. And I think we'll go to that point there. And if I can run out here and around, I want to get to the other side. And I'm thinking, since I want to do a refrigerator, once I level up, I can do that. And then what what side will this go on? Let's see here. Six. Oh, we'll go on this side. Okay. Okay. We'll just kind of put that up there, and then I am going to go ahead and place that. And I don't know where I'm going to take that to yet, but it'll go somewhere. Let's see what it looks like going through the wall. That's actually a good spot, because I can put my, my fridge there and everything. And then we also, I made a industrial grill that I can use. And I don't necessarily want to put it there, but let's go ahead and bring it back here a little bit. I think that's a good spot. Let's go ahead and place that. So now we can have all kinds of meats. So yeah, all right. Well, now I don't have anything to run in the, the fridge yet or in the generator. I don't have anything to run the generator on. So I don't think that I'm going to run it yet because I'm not high enough level, unfortunately, to get the refrigerator. Or I don't have enough Ingram points to get the refrigerator. It only takes 20. So, I'm thinking... Alright, so we've got probably all we're going to do there. Let's go ahead and grab that. We're starving. Let's eat some berries. I can't wait to get some a refrigerator going. That way I can cook some large amounts of meat and actually have some decent amounts of food. Alright, we've got our metal there, metal there. You can check this guy structures and then uh, i 
think that's probably going to be about it. I, I don't know that I can do much else today. But guys, I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooping Evolved server, the vanilla server that is. My name is Drax. Have a good one.